Hi my dear children welcome back to English class I am Sabita Joseph your English teacher children i hope you all are safe healthy and happy children now we are discussing the lesson lesson number 12 a mosquito isn't it yes i hope you all are reading the textbook daily you are good children i know last day we discussed the question answers and the grammar sentence isn't it yes today we'll discuss another grammar session that is wh questions okay are you ready for today's class yes children can you see some words here can you read it yes who which were what and when can you repeat it who which were what and when children these words are wh question words okay so we use these words to ask something to make questions for example what is the time now where are you going who is that see children here we use these words to make questions and these questions start with the letters wh isn't it yes and at the end of the sentence there will be a question mark because it is questions we use this words to make questions so these words are known as wh question words the first one we are discussing here is who we use this as a question word to ask about people for example who is that boy who is that boy and so that is my brother tom my brother tom here we use who to ask about a person isn't it who is that boy next one who is your friend who is your friend and so my friend is ammu my friend is ammu here we use this question word who to know about a person that is friend who is your friend who is that k the answer is my friend is ammu so we use the question word who to ask about people okay the next question word which which refers to set of choices if there is more than one thing we can choose any one of them okay so when we have to choose something we can use the question word which for example which is your apple if there is green red apple or the we can ask which is your apple the answer can be the green one or it can be the red one next question which one is your car if it is in the parking area there are lot of car you can ask which is your car and the answer can be that red one or that black one okay so your example i given is the red one okay so we use which to refer the choices if there is more than one thing we can use which to ask as a question word okay let's discuss the next one next wh question word is word we use the question word word to ask the place or location okay for example where is your book where is your book i'm asking where is your book the answer can be it is in the bag next one where are you from where are you from where is your place answer i am from india so here we can see the position of something where is something where is your book the book is in the bag then where are you from i am from india so we use the question word were to ask the place or position of something okay next one is what we use the question word what to ask about the information we use the question word what 
to ask information about any object, idea, or action. Okay, for example, what is on the table? I'm asking, what is on the table? Okay, the answer, there is a pencil on the table. So, I'm asking about, asking the information about the object on that table. What is that? That was a pencil. So, the question, what is on the table? There is a pencil on the table. Next one, what time is it? What time is it? I want to know the information about the time. Okay, it is 8 o'clock. It is 8 o'clock. So, we use what to get information about any object or any idea or any action. Okay, now let's discuss the next double H question that is when. We use the question word when to know about a time or a day. For example, when are you going? When are you going? I'm asking the day. When are you going? Answer on Monday. Next one. When is the party? It is on Friday at 2 p.m. Here we use the question word when to ask about the time or day. Okay. Children, today we learned WH question word. Now, Let's do an activity. Here you have to fill the blanks with suitable WH question word. Today we learned five WH question word. What are they? They are what, were, which, when and who. Okay. So you use the suitable question word here. The answer is given. So using this answer we can find out the question word. Okay. Dash this Asha leave. Dash does Asha leave? The answer is given. Asha lives in Mumbai. Here it says about a place. Okay. So the question word must be Where does Asha leave? Where does? Where does Asha leave? Asha lives in Mumbai. Next one. Dash is this? Dash is this? The answer. This is a bird. This is a bird. So what is the question might be? So we are asking about information about a bird. We are asking an information. For that we use the question, WH question, what? What? What is this? This is a bird. Next one. Dash is at the door. Answer. Tom is at the door. So we are asking about a person. This is a Tom is a Tom is a person. So which, which question we can use here? We can use who? Who is at the door? Tom is at the door. Okay, so we use the question word using the answers given. Okay, like this in our textbook, there is an activity. Let's do that. Now let's do the textual exercise, page number 71. Complete the following questions using the answers given. Okay, so here you can see the question and here we can see the answer. Okay, so we have to use the suitable WH question word here. Okay, dash is the time. That is the question answer is given. It is 4 o'clock. So here we are asking the time. Okay, is the time. So we are asking the information. So, if you want to ask information, which question will be used? Yes, we use the question word, what? So, and then the question will be, what is the time? Okay, next one. Dash bird has a red beak. And so, the parrot has a red beak. There are a lot of birds in this world, right? So, we are asking about a particular bird. So, it is choice. If you want to ask choice, which question will be used? We use which? Which bird has a red beak? Because there are a lot of birds with beak. So, if you want to know about a particular bird, okay? So, for that, we are using the choice. That's why using the question word which? Which bird has a red beak? The answer is 
the parrot has a red beak. Next one, Dad, do you live? I live in Kolkata. It is a place. Yes, if it is a place, which question will be used? Where? Yes. Where do you live? I live in Kolkata. The next one, Dad, is that boy? And sir, he is my brother. So we are asking about a person, isn't it? For that, which question will be used? Who? So we can write here. Who is that boy? He is my brother. Next one. Dash, do you go to school? That is the question. Answer. I go to school at 8 o'clock. I go to school at 8 o'clock. It is the time when we are doing that action. So the question will be asking the time. For that we can use the question word when. When do you go to school? I go to school at 8 o'clock. So I'll read the question answer once more. What is the time? It is 4 o'clock. Here we using what to know the information, to get the information. Next one. Which bird has a red beak? The parrot has a red beak. Here it is choice. If it is more than one bird or one thing, for that we can use the question word which. Where do you live? I live in Kolkata. Here we are asking the place. Okay. Who is that boy? He is my brother. Here we are asking about a person. For that we can use who. When do you go to school? I go to school at 8 o'clock. Here we are asking the time. When you are going. Okay. I go to school at 8 o'clock. So children, these are the question words we learned today. They are what, which, where, who and when. Children, I hope you all understood today's class. Today we discussed the grammar session WH questions. Complete the textual exercises by yourself. I hope you all are reading the textbook daily. If you are not reading, start reading the textbook by today itself. Okay, we will meet next day. Until then, take care. God bless you and bye.